Hello and welcome in. This is Aid, founder of Groups Watcher. I'm going to take you step by step on how you can use Groups Watcher so you can monitor Facebook groups and get notifications. So of course, when you first open the extension, you found this video right here. Please read these steps because they will help you. So first thing you want to do when you first download it is choose how you want to get notifications. I'm going to walk you through each one of them and how you can use it. First thing first, we have Slack. So let's say you have a workplace in Slack and you want to get notified about new Facebook posts in there. You just want to go to Google and search for Slack API. Then you want to go to your apps. And here you want to create new app. Then from scratch, enter any name. It does not matter. Then here you want to select a workspace. Then click on create app. After it's created, it's going to take you to this page. You want to click on incoming webhooks. You want to activate it. Then scroll down and you want to click on add new webhook to workspace. Here you want to choose where you want to get notified. For example, I'm going with WD, which is just a test channel I created. Then I'm going to click on allow. After I clicked on allow, it took me to this page. Now I can scroll down and go to here and copy this webhook URL. All right, once you copy that URL, you can click on here, then you enter the Slack webhook. You send the verification code. And basically it says that verification code sent to Slack. So you go to the Slack channel and it says here your verification code is 8208. You copy that, you paste it and you're ready to go now whenever there's a new facebook post it's going to send you to here just like this then we have discord so i created this test channel you can go to edit channel then go to integrations webhooks create webhook and you can click new webhook you can name it whatever you like then you can copy the webhook url then you just paste it into here and it says verification code sent to Discord. And here is the code. We copy this and we paste it. Now you will get notified on both Slack and Discord. Then we have Netify or NetFee. NetFee is basically a push notification service. So it sends you a push notification to your phone and you can also get push notification to your computer which shows like right here if you want to get notified on your phone you're just gonna go to the apple store or google play and download the app the name of the app is exactly as this ntfy so you're gonna go to netfi.sh and then you're gonna enter the topic name so for example i chose this name right here i can copy the full url and paste it into here this is our webhook they got the code they copy this i paste it right here and we're ready to go now when you download the app on your phone it's going to ask you for a topic name you just enter the topic name which is at the end of the url for email it's coming soon so i'm not going to go over it but it's going to be basically almost the same thing you're just going to enter your email and then you're going to get a verification code in your email you enter it and you're ready to go then we have groups here you can see all the facebook groups that you are in you can refresh them Whenever you join a new Facebook group, you're going to need to refresh it if you want to monitor it. So let's try refresh. All right, it fetched all of them again. You can select all of them, deselect, you can search through them. And you can also sort the groups A to Z, Z to A, members count low to high, which is going to show you the lowest first. Or you can go high to low, which is going to show you the highest members count to the lowest. Then we have privacy A to Z and Z to A, which just basically shows you private groups first, then public groups or the opposite. Then we have the monitor page. We have settings right here, only two of them. First one is change wait times, which just basically means how often do you want the extension to check for new post. I recommend you leave it as is, which is one to three. But if you want to get notified faster, you can change that right here. It will of course show you an alert here. There is a risk if you keep the check time very low. 
that's why we recommend you keep it one to three then you have the use keywords sometimes you don't want to get notified of every new single facebook post you only want to get notified for example if a post contain the word taxes so you can enter a positive keyword let's say taxes maybe tax help you can comma separate the keywords so now we will only get notified about a post if it contains any of these keywords right here and you can do the same for negative keywords let's say you don't want to get notified of a post that contains the word houston so now the extension is going to send you every post that contains the word taxes or tax help and does not contain the word houston for now i'm going to keep this off which just means it's going to send me every single new post it finds in any of the facebook groups that i select here of course i have zero facebook groups selected so if i click start it's going to show an error no groups selected select at least one group so let's do that i will select all of them then go back now it's 40 let's start to this all right one minute later it found five new posts and it sent me the notifications for them of course most of them are spam because i did not set any keywords and i just joined a bunch of random groups just to show you how it works to show you the name of the person that posted it the group url and the text and if you click anywhere in here it's going to take you to the facebook post also let me know if you want to customize the way the notification looks i can do that for you as well and i of course also got notified on slack because i set both of them and also discord as you can see i got notified on three of them you of course don't need to set up all of them you just need minimum of one and you're ready to go then we have Bellink, which is going to take you to our website here i'm on the free trial you can upgrade to monthly yearly lifetime and it depends on when you're watching the video maybe there's 50 off maybe not it's only for first couple of users it's just like buying any other product you just click on purchase it's going to take you to payment processor and once you pay you go back to the extension and you'll see that you have a premium subscription last thing we have is support you can contact support which is going to take you to our website and here you can fill a form or if there is something happened within the extension itself let's say you tried to start it but it did not start or anything that happened you can report crash and if you have any feature they want to have like customizing notifications whatever the case is you can click on request a feature and write us a message we usually add features within 24 hours so don't be shy ask what you need this is pretty much it thank you for downloading groups watcher and have a good one